solve this equation 2 over x minus 3 halves equals 7 over 2x. Uh, let's copy the equation down and put a little space between the terms. Okay. Now the denominator here is x, the denominator here is 2, and the denominator here is 2x. So what is the least common denominator for these? 2x is the least common denominator. Now if I put that here, and I'll write it as a fraction by the way, and put it here and here, watch what happens to our fractions. Here the x's cancel, that leaves you 2 times 2. Here the 2's cancel, that leaves you x times 3, don't forget your negative. That equals, and the, here the 2 x's cancels, that leaves you the 7. So by putting this 2x over 1 on all three of these, we get rid of all the fractions. Okay, our number one enemy is fractions, and we got rid of it. Our number two enemy is this negative coefficient here. Okay? Whenever you have a negative coefficient, and coefficient is the number in front of x, whenever this is negative, you have a good chance of missing this problem. Okay? So we want to get rid of that negative 3x. So I'm going to add 3x here and over here. Okay? Bring down the 4. Bring down the 7 bring down the 3x. So I still have my 4, which I had before. I still have the 3x here, and I still have the 7, but what do we take care of? We got rid of the negative sign by doing this. Okay? Now, what number is next to x? Well, you say 3 is next to x, but that's the coefficient of the variable. We'll divide by 3 later on. So what other number other than 3 is next to the x? This number here, right? So we will subtract 7 from both sides. So $4 in your bank account. You spend 7, so you're $3 overdrawn. Okay. These cancel. That gives you your 3x here. So now, now we're going to divide by the 3. Divide both of these by the coefficient of the variable, the positive 3. So we have negative 3 over 3, and we have 3x over 3. Okay. Now 3x over 3. 3 over 3 is 1, and 1 times x is x. Okay, so x equals negative 3 over 3 is a negative 1. And I'm going to put the x on the left-hand side. x equals negative 1. 